Okay, welcome back to Cletex Atrix. Okay, as you guys know by now, uh, we've been pretty much uh, going into this RC hobby for a while now. Okay, so cleaning this RC shells have been quite a challenge for us, especially uh, when it comes to drying. So, yesterday when we were at the electrical store, we came across this new toy. And as you know, Cletex, uh, we are always curious about the latest technology. Yeah, well, that's just an excuse. But anyhow, uh, thanks to Jason at the electrical store, we were totally soaked. Okay, this is apparently, apparently, because you know it's not even, it's still sealed and not open yet, the world's quietest uh, hair dryer. Okay, to us right now, it's probably the world's most expensive. We got this at $600. Okay, anyhow, uh, this hair dryer apparently has many many uh, capabilities uh, I'm just gonna keep this screen for a while so that you guys can have a quick read at it okay air multiplier technolo technology this was pretty much uh, the main the main cell on, 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 on this hair dryer itself and apparently uh, for this for women out there this hair dryer dries your hair uh, a lot faster. Okay, so we're just going to proceed to unbox this one. Okay. okay. There goes plastic, and basically, you know, just like this. Um, Looks fairly simple. Okay, let's just do a little a quick review on this. Okay, as you can see, I think uh, it comes with uh, three nozzles. One's the smoothing nozzle, one's the styling concentrator, and this is the diffuser. Apparently, this is for curly hair. Uh, no curly hairs on our uh, RC cars, though. Okay, so here's how this thing really looks. Uh, the different nozzles here. Like we saw, okay, there we go. And what's this? I don't know. Okay, but this is how the actual thing looks like. It doesn't even look like a hair dryer, actually. I mean, you guys don't get the wrong idea. Are you guys out there? Okay, this is not something for you to play with at night. Okay, uh, let's just see how these nozzles get on. Oh! So it's magnetic, so uh, uh, unlike the conventional hair dryers where you know you gotta you gotta twist and turn to get it on, these things just clip on nicely. And yeah, and let's just see how, how the others go on. Yep, works. And this one for the curly hair. Okay, there we go. So it looks good. Looks slick. Looks like perfect. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is uh, we're gonna just uh, see whether it. It's as quiet as what Jason mentioned it would be yesterday. Okay, so let's proceed. Okay, so this is the actual thing. Uh, we've got it plugged in. Uh, just a quick review. This one is we've got the stalling nozzle on, so that's how it goes again. And basically the on-off button is here, so we just flip it up, we turn it on. Okay, the button on the left here controls the fan speed. Okay, so that's uh, the lowest. And this button on the right here, the one with the red, dot is controls the heat so different temperatures all at the east of your control okay so we're just gonna try this uh, on the magazine okay I'm gonna put that heavy pitch up and this is basically how hold on too heavy I think so, it's just an idea of how it works a good concentration on the spot that you want uh, I think this should probably work well for our drying of the, the our RC car. Okay, so next we're just gonna do a comparison with a conventional hair dryer. Okay, so you heard you heard that sound there, and we do have one. Uh, it's the old-fashioned one here. Let's listen to this. Just the sound alone. I'm not sure if you can even hear my voice or not. 
but this is so basically Jason didn't lie it's the world's quietest hair dryer today and the world's most expensive one of course okay okay uh, so we're gonna put this to the test uh, basically this is the a different nozzle from the earlier one this is the Starling concentrator which means uh, it really focus, uh, focuses the, 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 the air blown at a specific uh, areas. I think that's probably what we're going to need. Okay, so we're just going to put this down. Uh, this is our Ferrari shell. Uh, what we're going to do is going to get this boy wet first. I'm going to dip this in water. Okay, just get both sides wet as well. So basically, car wash. Okay, so now I'm gonna put this on here and now we're gonna put this to the test. Alright. Okay, take out the water. And basically the beating is fair, you can see. I'm just going to focus on the front here. Yes. 